Hey beautiful and welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who I haven't met before, I'm Emma Ryder, psychic medium and divine channeler, and this is the Aquarius reading. Please bear in mind that as a rule, all of my readings are timeless and you will find the guidance that is right for you when you need to hear it. Whether that is today, next week, next month, trust in divine timing. Spirit will always show up with what you need to see or hear just at the right time. Okay, so to begin with, I feel like I'm going to pick a mirror truth card for an overall energy of the reading. And then I'm going to use the Troubadour Tarot and for your extended reading, the link is below, I will use the Light Seer Tarot. Okay, so let's have a look and see what you need to know. Deep breath, Aquarius. You're doing good. It's okay to need a breather. It's okay to have to step back. It's okay to just want to be. Okay, keep reminding yourself of that. And your mirror truth card is the bear. Remembering you can be strong and quiet all at the same time. That is what it feels like. I want the next card too heart so there's a love situation around you where you're needing to be strong and I want to say deal with issues in a silent strong way instead of feeling angry and frustrated your quietness and your strength will pay off okay I also notice that the Bears card is a family unit. So no matter whatever energies you're feeling at the moment, which aren't positive moving forwards to this love, remember that you will be that family unit. So work through your anger, frustration in a quiet, calm strong way it's the best way to move forwards okay remembering you are moving forwards and you're heading towards where you want to be so stay calm okay queen of cups queen of chalices and you've got this offer of love coming here. So the love is coming. You're maybe being faced with a situation, maybe just because you've been waiting so long, or um, it's just taking so long, or you're seeing them doing something stupid which you think isn't beneficial and moving you forwards. Stay calm because you are moving forwards. You are making progress. You're heading there. You're getting there. You are nearly there. There is that love offer coming in, the love opportunity. And it's it's always been there. It's just not quite got to the time where it needs to be. <laughs> then we've got the moon card, which is all about divine timing. And this is the right time for their love to come in and be offered to you, be shown to you, be spoken to you. It was always going to happen now because now is the right time, which I know is frustrating as well. All that divine timing stuff is very, very difficult when you're waiting for something to happen. But it is paying off. Then we've got the King of Chalices. So you're offering the love back to this person. This love is mutual. This love is equal. Okay. It's um, now a time for action and less talking, I want to say. Because we have the Ace of Green. And if this fish didn't take action now, it wouldn't be eating that fly. And it really does feel like this action... 
needs not to be delayed anymore. So I would say you're going to be quite shocked at how soon your love opportunity offering comes in and it's important to take action back. This is a mutual two-way thing. You've both got to be taking action. It's not all just going to come to you if you don't do what you're feeling drawn to do. And I say feeling drawn to do because I feel like spirit, the angels, are guiding you to take certain action. Make sure you're listening to that. If you feel like you need to be at a certain place or make a certain phone call, say a certain thing, do it. Take the action you're feeling drawn to. That drawn, the angels can give you the information through your soul into your heart so it can feel like it's coming from you and it's actually angelic scent, okay? So follow your heart, follow your intuition, follow the guidance. This is a two-way thing and action is needed. It's very mutual so you've not to worry about that. The love is both sides. Listen. My ears are itchy. Make sure you're listening. Whether it's to your person or somebody advising you something else, make sure you're listening because guidance can come in many different ways as well. Then we've got the Seven of Chalices, the Seven of Cups, which is an abundance of love. This love is going to be bigger than you're expecting. Bigger than you possibly knew love could be. There's a lot of love to be had in this relationship. Action is needed. I just keep hearing action is needed. So make sure you take this action to help bring it together and move forwards quicker. Okay, I feel like that is a perfect place to head over to your extended reading now to find out more information and clarification around this situation and more how you're going to move it forwards. If this is where you leave me, then thank you so very much for joining me. As always, it is a pleasure. Please make sure to take that action. Do me a massive favour and like and comment on the video. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Take care, stay safe, and I will see you soon. Namaste. Bye.